Hi everyone, this is Stani. So the energy's been kind of crazy today. So I thought I would do a check-in for you. So let's see what's going on in this collective. I'm not gonna like say anything specific. I'm just gonna see what's going on. So what does this collective need to know? This could be for anyone, basically. I feel like someone needs a message. Um, it doesn't have to be twin flames. We both know I'm not the one for you. So I feel like some of you are dealing with someone that is very unavailable and very um, hot and cold with their energy. So what they're telling you right now is, you know, you deserve better, basically. I lost myself for a little while. I feel like this has to do with you watching. Um, you lost yourself in this person that isn't good for you. And you know that. So you have to like regroup. I want you. So I feel like this person is saying to you that they want you. But they know that, you know, they're not good for you. Um, you lost yourself for a little while. They want you, but I feel like they're hiding their feelings. And they love you unconditionally, but I feel like this is your energy. Like, for whoever's watching, you love them unconditionally. Like, meaning they wronged you so many times. They sabotaged your relationship. You lost yourself. Um, you know, you want them. They want you, right. But let's see why they want you. Because I feel like there's some type of codependency here. But you love them unconditionally <clears throat> my throat is acting up again um i hide behind material things <clears throat> so yeah this person doesn't speak their truth so my throat chakra is acting up um they're not telling you what they really want with this situation because they're not being honest they hide behind material things so they are like being shallow this might be like shallow people um, money, you know, they, they're focused not on love. They're not focused on like what you're focused on them. You know, it's like they want you, but why do they want you? So whoever needs to hear this message, let's see. Let's look into why they want you, right? Because I feel like there's some hidden agendas here. Now this could be a friend, this could be romance. This could be even family, like you love a family member unconditionally, but they take, 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 take. So the theme of the day are people, like the energy, people keep like draining and taking advantage. You have to put a foot down. So King of Pentacles, yeah, like I said, this person has like this want, want, me, me, me. This is the theme, like they're taking advantage of you. So they might be interested in you, not for love, but for money with the King of Pentacles. They're focused on their coins, they're focused on money. There's nothing loving about this, okay? There's nothing loving about this energy. So that's why they want you, like I said. Um, and that's why they're saying to you, they know that you're they're not the one for you. But you want this offer, oops. You want this offer. Okay, you want this love offer with the Knight of Cups, but they don't want it. So you have to reflect. You have to think about like, do you want to deal with this person? This person is not loving you, okay, the way you're loving them. They're looking at their options. And this could be you too, like sleepless nights, because they're looking at their options. Um, they're like, oh, all that glitters, all that glitters isn't gold. Okay, but this person has lessons to learn. So, overall, what is the action they're going to take towards you right now? Wow. So, they're probably not, like, taking any action towards you with the hanging man. Like, they're not going to take any action towards what you want. They're not going to give you what you want. So, like I said, they're hiding behind material things. They're not interested in what you want, okay? They're not interested in love, basically. Um, they're being greedy with the Nine of Cups in reverse. That's someone who's very greedy. You know, look at them. They're eating with it in being in reverse. That's like someone who's being gluttonous, which is a sin, basically. They're just taking, taking, taking. 
you know, that is the energy of the theme of the day. And I had to do this reading because, you know, they want you, sure, they could promise you the world, but it's not for kosher reasons, honey. Like, you need to reflect whoever this message is for. I'm telling you, just be careful because they don't have their the same um, ulterior motive. Like, I feel like some of you are dealing with karmic situations and this person is a karmic and they're taking from you because that is like toxic energy and it's like a codependency. So whoever this message is for, I hope this like gave you a sign, gave you a message, okay? So like, share, and subscribe and... If you like my readings or whatever, you can hit me up. My information is below. Bye.